This a jungle loud. This a this a this a jungle loud. Crying out loud. This a this a this a jungle loud. There and the hunt is on. A jungle loud. There and the hunt is on. We gonna hunt you down. We gonna hunt you down. We gonna come, we ain't playing, it's the last thing on our minds Stop crying much if you really, really wanna stop crying Be safe when you're home, be safe when the streets It's a cold place and I'm really feeling the heat I never wear gold, cause someone's always beeping by the fans I still cry much, came and give TNT confidence I had a dream in the dark, I had a dream in the spring I had a dream, I had a dream like my new There's king. a jungle out there and the hunt is on A jungle out there and the hunt is on We gonna hunt you down, hunt you down there's a jungle out there and the hunt is on A jungle out there and the hunt is on We gonna hunt you down I good evening ladies and gentlemen, this is Ian Allen, this is Crime Watch and we're back top of the evening to you. All those of you who are locked online, a special good evening to you. All those of you who are looking at me, who are looking at me from all over the world, a special good evening to you. Well ladies and gentlemen, you know, today we want to take some calls, I want to hear from you. You know ladies and gentlemen, today they, they stole a car from its center mall, they agree aqua. I have the number here, it's, it's really it's terrible, terrible. And, and a young guy, a, a, in fact, a woman parked a vehicle a short while ago in the Mid Center Mall. In Mid Center Mall. And um, a great aqua. Yeah. Papa Echo Bravo PEB 3220. It's a, yeah, it's a PEB aqua. A grey. Right? And, you know. Park, the, the woman parked her car in, in Mid Center Mall and it's gone. It's gone. So if you, see, if, you, if, if you should see that car anywhere, let me know. That's what I tell you, you, know, you have to be real careful out here. Things different and people and people only joking around, only funning around. Only funning around. Only fun, they, you know. Let me tell you something. The circus in Trinidad done, you know. Tr Trinidad is not a circus, you know. And it, it might be a circus for a lot of people, but it is not a circus. There's a time for fun, and there's a time for seriousness. And you would have noticed that with the change of my show, that I realized that maybe for, for Christmas, we have some Jones and, as they say, some fun or wrong and thing. But other than that, this is serious times, and people, people need help. And, you know, it's challenging for some people. People lose their car. All that, people are going through challenges. People are going through challenges. And it's like certain people don't understand that. How you can really come out here and make a, a, a significant contribution. You understand? Come and make a significant contribution. Um, A woman was found, you know, I, I need to tell you this, that it, it, it's terrible, yeah? Women, you know, women under attack. Women under attack. Women are under attack in this country. Women are being beaten, slap up. Women are being, being you know, they are, they are under attack. And, you know, more, wo you know, more wo women's group need to come out and speak out against the abuse. Abuse against women out there. Just, you know, just today, ladies and gentlemen, a woman was found murdered near her house located opposite the Claxton Bay Cemetery early today, Thursday, the 19th of January. The victim has been identified as 41-year-old Leela Ramsubag, a mother of two. I do not know why I feel I know this lady. I do not know why. I feel that I've seen her somewhere. I do not know why. It is so sad. It is so sad. Around 9 30, Corporal Babulal and WPC Batiste, one mobile patrol, when they got a report of a woman lying motionless in the vicinity of the southern main road in Claxton Bay. Upon arrival, they discovered the victim lying face down with blood coming out of her nose and the back of her head. You really think it easy in this place? You really, really think it easy? She was also topless, clad in her black leggings, pulled below her buttocks with a pair of black rubber slippers near her body. It is believed that Ramsubag was assaulted and killed, and she was found nude with blood to the back of her head and anus. Anybody from that area could tell me what's going on? Anybody from that area could go to ianallen.org and let me know what's happening. Anybody? Anybody can let me know what's happening. 
Anybody has information with respect to the senseless killing of this woman, a mother of two? What's going to happen with the two children? So many people have lost their lives in the last few years in Trinidad. Thousands of persons who died as a result of COVID. Their children who lost mother and father, their children who lost their guardian, their children who stayed by their grandparents and their grandparents died of COVID. And you know, we have no social service plans in place to assist these children, nothing to assist these children to take them to our next level. We don't have that in place. And these are the things that should be highlighted. But nobody, instead of all that, we come with fun, circus thing, circus, only circus. Everything is a joke in Trinidad. What's going to happen with, this, with, with Leela Ram, Subak, two children? What's going to happen? By now, social services should have visited that the, the family, put measures in place where the children staying. I could put my neck on a block, ladies and gentlemen. I could put my neck on a block that nobody visited these people. I have gone to countless crime scenes. Countless. I have visited countless people who lost their father, their mother, or their grandmother, and who stayed at their relative's home. And they, they always ask, did anybody from social services visit you or, or you know, with any assistance, see how they could help? No, nobody. Nobody, Mr. Allen, nobody. And it's sad, it's sad, it's sad. Yet we could find 80-something million dollars to, to upgrade our stadium. Like, who, what a stadium could really do for us? We can find 80 something million. Yet in times like this, where I believe we should have just party on our own and fed on our own and have our thing in our, on our island on our own, just to secure us from any external persons coming in with any, you know, COVID business into this country. Because we already want to set back things. Nice. It, it's it's 4,000 people we don't lose already. 4,000. See, here not to lose 4,000 people in Trinidad. In the last two years, it is easy, you know. It's not easy. It is not easy. And this is a small population, yeah? This is a small population. 5% of the population. Let's imagine that. 4,000 people gone already. COVID. And that is sad. That is really, really, really sad. But yet... It is a circus for plenty of people. It is a circus. It is clung in a wrong. Just clung, just clungs. And the thing is, when you get serious, you're not supporting them. You're going on the other side. You're PNM. You're this, you're that. People are sick and tired of games in this country. Sick and tired. Maybe years before the pandemic, everything was a joke. Comedy could have comedy could sell in Trinidad. Not again. Not again. People taking life serious now. People trying to make a dollar. People go in and buy five cases of water, sell it to make a 150 or 200 dollars. Once they can make a day work, they're going to sell that and go home. People getting vexed when rain falls because the car plaster, they, they, they are missing upset because, because he can't get no work when rain falls. Long time, you can say, well, I hear what? I'll go and cook a duck, I'll go and make a lime, I'll go and buy a bottle and chill out. Now times are different. People in more, in more of like, like more of more of a serious mood right now, but yet there are persons who hold office in this country clung around, clung just clung, and jokes and that is not selling anymore. I'm not angry with anybody you now, but you all need to stop that. You all need to stop it. And I'll tell you why I'm like that today. I'll tell you why I am like that today. I will tell you why I'm like that today. I sure if I ask Donna Cox, tell me the persons who, what, what, what about how many people, we will have these figures, we will have the figures when you go to the hospital and, you know, if you're if you a pastor, when you, you're, you're lazy with the hospital, father so and so, you're your father too, he's the, only, he's the only breadwinner in the house, he died of COVID, or a single mother, she passed of COVID, or the grandmother who said take care of the children and them, because that people just give up the children and let the mother see about the child. And the mother come and pass away of COVID. Where, where, what is the future of that child? That child is going to get a little job in a store? Or maybe a, like a little janitor work and that's it? No. 
persons in power, persons in position should use their influence to better the, lives, the, the, the livelihood of these children. And they are not doing that. They are not doing that at all. Everybody for themselves. Every single person in this country for themselves. You know, Ram Subag is the, is the second female murdered for the year thus far. The second female. Second woman. Yeah. I have, I have an off-camera interview today. Go ahead. Was a nice person. She liked to take she little drink and she little lime. Was she friendly? Just about everybody knew how to um, appreciate and, and have a good relationship with her, meaning friendship wise. You know? She's not a disrespectful person and things. She come around, she talk with everybody, she lime, she makes she joke, she pay a little pool, she enjoys herself and then she leave and she go home. You don't see her often, but when she do come out, she have a nice little time and she go. She a favorite in the area. Here with everybody. She never had any dispute or anything with anybody? Not that I know of. Okay. Because she always smiling, she always willing, she can ask her to do anything. She, she willing. So that's about as much as I know as her. She, so she was a nice person, a good one. Oh. Sorry that this had to happen to her, but hopefully, well, whoever did this will see the end. Wow. And I tell you this, I tell you this. I tell you this. I tell you this. You know, last night I was at a, a, a media party. All the media gathering they had for media personnel. Attorney Omlala had it at his office. I was invited. It was very interesting. I met a lot, a lot of people from different, from different networks out there. It was good. Man, um, managing director of this, of this media house, that media house, the editors and whatnot, was good. And wow, people look up to me, boy. Wow, people look up to me. People respect me. And I left, I left that little gathering. Just two glasses of wine. I just had a, maybe I think about two glasses of wine. And it was really nice. And times are different now. Times are different. Some of you might think we should get back to more back analysis. No, it doesn't sell anymore. There's serious things happening. When you could have a, a I mean, is the second female, the second woman, second female to be murdered. The, la the first was Kaylee Maloney. Kylie Maloney. Yeah. When little children could sing in a birthday party. And this is what persons in position should be talking about. When little children could sing in a birthday party, happy birthday to you, happy birthday, happy birthday. Hip -hip, hip hip hooray. And let me tell you something. There's nobody standing there. What's gonna what what exactly? Come back to me. What exactly is going going? What, what exactly is going on in the minds of these little children? What are you thinking? Trinidad is Everybody's a monster. Everybody's a killer. My friend is not there because somebody killed her. Hmm? We are the counselors, the social services. What we have in place to, you know, to help these little children. And it's not a matter, Lila. People, somebody tell me Lila was a lima. So, if what, so what if Lila was a lima? What if, Ram, if Lila Ramsubag was a lima? Oh, she likes to play a little pool. Maybe she lie more. She go to clubs. She go, but that doesn't give you, that doesn't give nobody the right. That does not give the body no nobody the right to do the girl with the, the, to kill the girl and have a topless and bleeding from a for bleed, bleeding from behind her head and all kind of thing. That does not give the right to nobody to do that. And no matter how much that do 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 matter how much how people uh, women certain people might live their lives. That doesn't give the right to nobody to kill nobody and beat nobody, you know. Whether they might be a lima, whether how much man they have, that don't give the right to nobody to do that. That is their decision. People must be respected. And that is why even on my show, I don't make homophobic statements. I don't. Everybody, everybody has the right to do to express what they to express themselves in whatever way they choose. And you keep that to yourself. But again, as I said, Trinidad has become a circus. I'm going to tell you how Trinidad has become a circus. I'm going to tell you how I listened to a, a senator, an opposition person today. 
Now, you know, when you talk about this, and I know Auntie might be watching, but Auntie know that I respect her a lot. And that is my friend. But sometimes you have to speak to these people and them and let them know. Not Auntie, but you have to speak to sometimes these senators and let them know that they're in a position of influence. And people are listening to you. People are listening. And there are more pressing matters to speak about than to just talk crap. I listening to, one, to a man saying today, he put up Rishi Sukai Pitti, as you know Rishi now has been, well he's a senator, and people might ask, how oh, you take up for Rishi? But it's not a matter why you taking up for Rishi. Rishi going to pay and a man nothing to do with me. I know Rishi the personality. Rishi Sukai the personality. I know the Sukais. From since I a little boy, I know the Sukais and them. My father, my father and the Sukais are great friends. They are great, great friends. Like visiting friends, like going home by them, like good friends. Rishi, my father knows Rishi, but Rishi has the utmost respect for my dad. Because he know his father and my father, they are best friends. And gone are the days when Carney was in, you know, Carney was in operation. They were the people who had the harvesters in Shagwanas. They are, they, they, you know, they were, they had a lot of people employed with them and whatnot. And that never moved them. And now they have the the the, the, the diesel place and whatnot. But that's not what I'm here to tell you. But you listen to people. You listen to people. You listen to people. And today I listened to a man put up Rishi Petya and telling the boy, put up, you put up Rishi Petya, right? Rishi Sukai Petya, and telling the boy, an opposition senator, yeah? and telling the fella, hola, hola, hola. And it's so stupid. Remember tell you why it's stupid? Because if the shoes was on the next foot, if the shoes was on the next foot, you wouldn't like nobody to make joke of you with no hotel room or whatever you, you know? You wouldn't like that. You would not like that. So if my friend here, my good friend, my good friend, you see, I will tell you something here, I will tell you something. I will tell you something. People don't think out of the box in this place, you know? Yeah, people don't think out of the box. People can have friends, people can respect you. Yeah, I know plenty of people. It have plenty of my neighbors I know. Great people, but they, they support PNM. Okay, that is, that is their choice. That is their choice. If I know the Prime Minister, who's who, 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 who might be coming by them, and they might say, well, I just find that not nah, good. I say, well, you know, I don't want to get no thing, you know. But if I should bounce up the, the whoever, the, 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 the Prime Minister or whoever, hello, how are you going? And that's it. I don't need to take no pity. And I said, hello, how are you going? And that's it. You don't have to be enemies and like, this is like, it's a your side and my side thing. We all have to live here. And that's why we must live in peace. That is what have us in this, in this kind of Kalaloo and this kind of bacchanal right now, you know, all this. And you listen to the senator, opposition senator, making fun. Hola, hola. And it's the same man, it's the same man who said, you remember when there was a, a, a rumor that the prime minister wife had a man and all kind of stupidness? Like, who cares? Who cares? Who cares? Who cares? Does anybody business? And you bring the woman in, the, in, the, in, the, in the, you bring Mrs. Rowley in the back and all. You see, you gotta understand something, eh? You gotta understand something. Politics has a morality of its own. And sometimes, when you're in public life, you have to take peacock, you have to take mashup. But now, we're in a different time. We're in a completely different time. After the pandemic, times have changed. People's mentality has changed. And those things don't sell no more. That, that, that is not fun. That is stupid. Come and tell us. Use your, I mean, you have a, you have, I guess you have a little following. Use your following to find out, well, What's happening with, with our borders? What about vaccination? If we have four cases come out since the, since the 10th of December, the 22nd, why the government took so long to come out and speak about? Those are the things people would like to hear. Those are the things people would like to hear. 
come and tell us it is so sad now. This woman, Leela, Leela Ramsubag, has been murdered, the second woman. He had a child. Come out and tell us 4,000 plus, 4,309 persons dead in this country. What is the role of the social services for those who died that children were dependent on? The, 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 the breadwinners. Where are those children of the 4,309 persons that died as a result of COVID? Where are they right now? Are they going to school? Do they have a meal? Do they have clothes on their back? Because let me mind you, when, let me tell you something. When a father dies in a house, that house becomes tip, how do you say? Topsy-turvy. My grandmother used to always say it becomes topsy-turvy. Things different. When a father dies in a house, things, there's no direction. Very few could manage the storm. That was a long time. Child had to stay here. This one had to get a little walk. So then this one might have to pull back from school. He can't go to, he, he can't further his education. He had to go and get a little garage work. He had to go and do something. Something he had to do in order. What about the father? What about the father who, who, who the truck, who was in the accident just before Christmas? Is just before Christmas? And his son spoke to him. What about the children who go into school? I think it's two, two boys, it's three, it's three children the guy have. And the truck crash, crash on him. Did anybody find out? Well, let me see what's going on. Did any minister go and say, well, what we can do? Could we write the Ministry of Social Development? See what we can do. See how we can get scholars. See what we can do. See, that is what people want to hear right now. People do not want back and all. And I keep telling people that every day. People are, I am fed up of that. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe as I get older, you become wise. But you can't put up a man picture because the man might have a girlfriend who might be of a, 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 a Spanish, a, a, a different national other than Trinidadian. And put up Rishi, Rishi Sukai picture and say, well, hola, this and hola. That is dumb. That is stupid. That is like stupid. You know why I take, you know, you know why I, why I'm upset? Because I know, I, I, I know them, I know them. We lime, we lime. Oh God, oh God, oh God, we lime. We lime. We lime. Oh God, relax on yourself a little bit now. So if I so 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 now so now he's okay. Now he's a pain himself. Would I lock him off? No, I will call him. Just I used to call him normal, and you know, I remember when when they started to advertise here, and the girl called him, and he said, "Oh, Mr. Allen, we will always support him. We will always it's just we know you, you. Why you all took so long to ask, ask Sukai Diesel to advertise?" He said, because we always support Ian. He's, a, he's a, you know, he's our boy. If I should see his father, I would say, hi, Mr. Hi, Mr. Sukai, how are you, sir? No, I said, don't come Mr. Allen. Call my father, Mr. Allen. But it, it's all about seriousness. And, 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 and the thing is that these people think that this is what sells. That is a joke. That is fun times. Talk about, find out, come with something, but, you know, Something better now, that's all. Come, come with something better now. Something with substance. Substance. People want their substance. And sometimes you need to look at what, you, what you, those, those in opposition, vice versa, what they are doing. You realize Rowley is doing everything in a very strategic way. In a very, very strategic way. He came to the, 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 the belly of the, as they say, well, you could say Shagona is, a, is a predominantly a, a UNC area. That's Shagona's west, that's Shagona's east. So west is UNC, Shagona's east. So Shagona's east is UNC. But that could be very challenging now. That could be challenging. Because the gentleman, that could be challenging now. That is something to, you know, pay special attention. And that is why every day I tell MPs, I tell everybody, you know, whether it be opposition, start visiting your constituents. Start go, going and visit. Don't come and tell me you can't walk there. Oh, that is not our stronghold. No, every area, every area, you can get support. You will be surprised how far a handshake, touch flesh a little bit, can go. Whether who, which party you might belong to. 
Those are the things that find out that something you're okay, I can't do nothing again, not, but still the very presence and you're still trying to help me. Like somebody, you can't help somebody, but the very call, you get back your car, boy. You get back your car. Well, I call Smith, I call this one, you get it back. Yeah, I get it back. But I like how you, you know that was very nice of you. Sometimes just just assist me, but even though you might fail and you can't do it. But now, nah, but the man is ready. Come and watch the thing, but the man ready. Come and see the road. Yeah, boy, come and he ready. Thing and thing. Those things can go a long way. And that is why you all need to stop this bacchanal and stop this stupidness. Pay attention because let me tell you something. These people have an undercurrent in the constituents, in every constituency that you don't even know. I mean, this take us, this take people by, by, by surprise. It doesn't take me by surprise. It doesn't take me by surprise, but it takes people by surprise. But everything is being done in a very strategic way. And something when people start to move in that kind of strategic kind of method, you have to take approach accordingly now. This is not a time to fun around. Because if it's a time to fun around, you'll stay there for the next hundred years. You understand? We need sensible contribution. Use your platform for seriousness. Maybe if you do that, things will be better. Why do you think I don't make fun of nobody and, and tell nobody about, about, take about nobody but the wife and if the wife of a man and oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God, oh God. There's not a platform for that. Maybe carnival, we could dance up and, and Christmas, we could have a glass and we could, we, we, you know, we, we, we'll have fun and something. We could have some Jones and things. But not every day is Jones because this is not a circus song anymore. This is not a joke anymore. This is a serious thing. When you could find a woman, a woman half naked on the road and, and, and blood coming out she hears and, and behind she head and all kind of thing. When you could have 4,000 persons dead, 4,309 persons dead as a result of COVID. What is your contribution? Tell me where are the social services for, the, for those who were dependent on who lost their parents here? Did they visit anybody? Did the government, did the social service, did Donna Cox anybody do? That's what people want to hear. So please, 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 give it a rest now. Come with something serious. I know some of you might not like that, but that is a day now. That is a day. That is a day. But partner, let me tell you something. Let me tell all you something. Let me tell all you something if I take this break here today. I, Ian Allen, you can't buy me. I, Ian Allen, you cannot buy me. I not for sale. And I am not a hungry man. Some of you might have your perception because you may, may be in a video to see an old door. But believe me, I don't talk. And I love that door. <laughs> you understand? But those who know me from my circle will know I am not a hungry man. And if I ever had to do anything, I'd have done do, do, do it already. All I want is a better Trinidad and Tobago. That's all I want. That's all I want. I, 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 I just want everybody to be happy. I fed up on the murders. I, I, I wish that social services are getting more involved and see about these children and, and, and so much things. So much pressing things right now. I happy for everybody now. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I realize everybody just want to move up. Everybody just want better better in their life. That is all. So if a man take a flick, so he do so, and he do this, and he do that, and I want to take a job, so I take a job, so everybody want to move up. Everybody want better man. So when I'm so when I'm not progressing in life, you should be happy. I'm happy for everybody, you know. I must have, I, I'm gonna say I'm fighting, I'm not fighting nothing. I I you know, I'm not fighting anything. I think that I'm doing extremely well. Despite some some day we might face some turbulence and whatnot. But I think I really flying. I think I think I'm doing extremely well. And even last night, and even last night, I take a break just now, and even last night in that media party, I I I, I heard different journalists and Person, the, the, the movers, now the movers and shakers in the media said, Mr. Allen, you're doing extreme. I couldn't believe that they are so, in, you know, inclined to what my show, what I do every day. I couldn't believe it. Like, okay, you okay, okay. But it was nice. It was nice. But if you are bad, talk to anybody and say, I ain't going to talk to this one. Come on, next station. By talking to everybody, I just know who I am. I know my value and I know my word. When you know your word, you don't need to only say, what do you think, what do you think? And mash up this one in order to gain strength. No. Know your word. Let's take a fast break. Marketing Company Limited and view our large stock of ready made wrought iron designs. Visit us at 44 Montrose Main Road, Chicwanas, or call 235 4283 Gate or 235 4766 Iron. 
Capacity Trading is your number one source for high quality, new and used Korean auto parts. We are well stocked and carry a wide variety of engines, starters, compressors, alternators, power steering pumps, fans, sensors, head and tail lights, bumpers, grills, shocks, cradles, steering racks, and so much more. Let us help you improve your car's performance. Come on down to lot number 78 Bamboo Number 2. Call us to get a quote at 645-2603 or WhatsApp at 704-2246. Automotive is what we do. Car City Trading. Quality products. Fantastic prices. Want Ian Allen live at your business and seen on television? Then book your live now and promote your business the best way you can. Get one hour of ad free live broadcasting on television and all our platforms. Don't wait, spots are going quickly, so book now. Call 294 4081 225 4327 or 225 3250. Attention all bakers, doubles vendors, and roti makers. Try our high-quality, bromate-free, all-purpose, and whole-wheat flour. Low price and conveniently packaged in 2 pounds, 2 kg, 10 kg, and 25 kg bags. For wholesale and retail prices, contact Chiquicho Limited at 665-3336 or 4808715. Or visit us at Warrenville Canopia. Chiquicho Limited. Quality you can trust. Here's another reason to advertise on Crime Watch. Over 45 million views on YouTube alone. In the last six years, an outstanding 40 million views for 2022 and on track to surpass that in 2023. In just the previous month, we have surpassed over 1 million views and close to 200,000 hours of watch time. Can you imagine the reach our YouTube platform will get you? Don't forget. Persons will also see your business every day by watching our live program on television, on our website, our iOS and Android applications, and of course, our Facebook page that boasts over 576,000 followers. Our packages are based on viewership so that your business can get the most exposure possible. Advertise where the people are watching. Advertise where it matters on Crime Watch. Now opened at our Montrose Shogunas branch, Tire Clinic's Truck Tire Department. With a faster tire changer, the largest service bay to facilitate all your heavy equipment needs. We carry tires for cars, motorcycles, or get your alignment done all at one spot. Call or visit us today. Passage to Asia, ultra all inclusive carnival kisses. Sunday, 5th February 2023, St. Andrew's Golf Course, Mocha, Marava. Get your tickets at Passage to Asia, Wings, Tuna Puna, Extra Food, Riverline, Price Plaza, MS Food City, Day Day, West Beach, Diego Martin, Richards, West Mall, Dave Sebelak Hardware, Pinal, S. Seepersad Hardware, Maravella, Grand Tech, Londonville, Lazy Lizard, Rodney Road. Call 672 2701 742 4309 685 8697 and 465 7322. Passage to Asia, carnival kisses. Just got your CXC or CAPE results? Then start your degree today at CTS College and choose from many of our pathways in business management, business administration, human resource management, marketing, finance, management information systems, computer engineering, computing and information systems. Full and partial scholarships are available. CTS College where education is beyond academics. Taxi, taxi, airport carry. Lauren, you better shake up. I don't know need your plane, and this white talk non-stop. My darling, you cannot leave me. Oil up is who are we, heading down to trainee. Baby, on the road is real must be playing. And white talk brings me vines to jump up juve more. <laughs> you see them masqueraders, everybody, the white talk ad, white talk advertising on crime watchers. You think it easy? You think it easy? Yeah. Or was a better place. So stop this thing and stop, you know, stop it, stop it. You know why I get like that? 
Sometimes, you know, I mean, it's, when they start look out, outside of the box, I think you, you look at people, look at what the, the politics in America. I mean, our, our society is different. Our culture is different. But you look how people could reason, how people could talk, how people could still shake a hand, you know. They could still bad mouth you, but they could still, at the end of the day, you know. <coughs> also, ladies and gentlemen, a man, in fact, those of you just joined us, I tell everybody, woman who was found dead today, Lila, ba Lila, Lila Ramsu, Ramsu Bag. Really sad. Really, really sad. A man who was gone down while cleaning the yard at Red Hill, extension and over exactly one week ago, had been positively identified by police. <coughs> the, the, the deceased is 38 year old Tyron Ramage, aka Wakaman, and Toto Man. Of Red Hill Extension. He was shot multiple times about the body shortly after 1 p.m. on Thursday, January. Police said Ramage, Ramage was cleaning the yard when he was approached by a man armed with, a, armed with an assault rifle. Suspect fired several shots at Ramage before fleeing the scene on foot. The victim was taken to a police pain hospital where he subsequently died. <coughs> Excuse. This is the deceased Toto Man. All right? Remember? Right? You know, why tell her, watch me, we really, watch me, we really don't take things serious, you know. You know, I, th I think it's daycare centers, boy. It's either, it's daycare centers or home with children. Something like that. I think it's daycare, or children home or daycare, I think it's a daycare center. <laughs> That, that the law now, they're going to proclaim the law, they're going, they're going to proclaim it by, let's say, March or sometime, that, yeah, but, but they had given them a deadline. Have, the, have, have their children home license or, or face shut down. Yeah, we're now doing that. And even with, with, with daycare, day, daycare out, you know, outside there, there are a lot of people just running daycare in this, in this country. You have a, you know, a flying hoot about how to even hold a child in her. But just somebody might invest and get about six crib and two, three girls who don't have no experience and might just dress them up in a kind of, you know, a motherly kind of look and taking care of people's children, you know, outside there, you know. Boy, this place is really crazy, yes? This place is really crazy. All these things, all these, all these things, people should be highlighting. Who in position? Highlight these things. Lobby for these things. Because how many children die at daycare centers and whatnot? How many people are Montessori trained to take care of a child? How many people are, are, are qualified to open a daycare center? So they take your child to a daycare because it's convenient. Somebody take the child to a daycare because it's right by the house there. It's right home. It's on the second, it's in the back street, so it's good. No, but you don't know. You don't know. Look at the woman, look at the woman from South. Mix a bottle, a titi bottle. Mix a titi bottle. Mix a titi bottle. For somebody yesterday. The child yesterday, Spanish child. We highlighted it yesterday. Right. Yeah, the four-month-old baby, but they say child died of nat natural causes, right? But I'm just showing you that cases where people feed, give children bottle and mix the bottle and then burp the child or whatever. We should already have laws in place in this land to make sure we have homes. Look, look at that people who have homes for the elderly. They yeah, have no license, nothing, beating time up. I, I know a particular home. I'm just shifting from the issues today. I know a particular home, tie up a man and a tie him up and a, when, he, when the daughter went back for him. But the man had blue black mark, mark all on his hands here. Tie up, tie in a. You can see? Tie up all by his foot. He mouth burst. Yeah, in a particular home. Because the people are not qualified, and those people might think that it's convenient because you know they, they, they go, they, they, they see about 10 beds, it's air conditioned, they're nice, they're nice.
But these, are these people qualified to take care of, your, of an elderly? All these things. But yet we choose to make back an all and have fun around and say, and say this and say that. You understand? And fun around and, you know? Why is my award from YouTube keep going like that? Right? So let me tell you our next story again. Let me tell you our next story. So the man, you remember the man was identified there who was gunned down. Also, I need to tell you something. February 28, 2023, will, make, will, will mark three years since three people were murdered and their homes set on fire at Guapo Village in Point Fourteen. Remember the three people that perished in a fire? The deceased victims, they were identified as uh, Cecilyn Farrell, a 69-year-old, her son, 48 year old Patrick Farrell and a family friend 41 year old Celeste it can't be Celeste Cecils Hannah Cecils Cecils Hannah they were they were all stabbed to death and the home was set on fire the 28th of February will make Three years, ladies and gentlemen, three years. Three years. Initially, police thought they died, of, they died as a result of a house fire, but crime scene investigators soon found evidence inside the burnt house which suggested the trio were first murdered. This was also confirmed by forensic pathologists at the Forensic Science Center in St. James, who... who who performed on the, 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 those that perished in the fire, which showed they were all starved to death. The investigations into the triple homicide took an extremely long period of time, given the fact that the DNA samples had to be sent abroad. Come back to me. It had to be sent abroad. We built in stadium, for, we, we, we refurbished in stadium. We spent 180 80 something million on a carnival. But imagine, we want to play rankers out here. But there are people, ladies and gentlemen, who have been waiting for over a year to two years to still find out if the skeleton remained that police found, if that, was, if that was their brother or sister or their son. They're still waiting. We still have to, we still, just imagine, it will make three years, eh? three years, February 28th this year, it will make three years, and there is no closure one person was held he was he he was a uh, he, he was um released because of insufficient evidence now it just took a turn i don't want to i don't I, I do want to make i, I don't want to make no no comment as yet but because now it has reached a very sensitive stage because apparently um let me, let me let me just go on today i can inform you that the DNA, the DNA evidence recently came back from the UK and investigators are following several leads in that triple murder in Point 14. But what I just said here will rock Point 14. But after so much years, for a family to now get closure, for the, I can't blame the police. I'm not blaming the police. But this is what we should be there. There are people who are in office. This is what they should be lobbying for. Lobbying. Instead of talking about people, wife, instead of talking about who are Spanish women, this is what we should be using our platform for, lobbying. Lobbying for these things. I can tell anybody I have used my platform. And I have used it wisely. That's the reason we have 45 million persons from 2016 to now. Yeah, I can tell you that. I can tell you, I can tell, I can tell you that is why in 28 days, we are 20, we are, I have over 1 million persons who watch my show. I could tell you that, that t t today is the 18th, but today is the 19th, the 19th of January, and so far 656,000 persons, 434. Watch Crime Watch, Dandai just YouTube, I could tell you that. Because they know what's going on in America, they, they know what's going on in Trinidad, they see cases solved, they see we did this, they see we give out hampers, we see we do this, we do this, we do that, all kind of thing. We help people because I use my use the platform for, some, for something positive. Why we can't use, why you can't use your platforms wherever you are 
and, and, and lobby, lobby, pass legislation that see if we can pass legislation and focus on getting a, a lab, a DNA lab that people don't have to wait years anymore. Imagine after, this will make it three years and evidence, the sample results now come back. You know, people I know waiting, waiting to, waiting because their, their, their family was found burned to death. And they want to know the cause of that and they're still waiting. It's a long list because you see how people dropping like flies in Trinidad. It's a long list. Why we can't lobby for things like this? Tell me why. But when you talk, it's like you join the next side. It's like you join the next side. I find, you know, we're nothing back on our thing. I'm not in this. Hi, caller. Good evening. You're live on crime. I'm good evening. Yeah, I'm good. I call him a clock from here. And I don't like the way the woman saying about the, the girl um, that the, the, the way I get where they get killed. Eh? Yeah, I, I no, no, she was just giving, she was just saying, I'm not, just I just have a, a lay person just and explaining she just, that um, she liked to lie and this and that, and, but still, she's right, there. Well, you can't tell people the private life. But what they like to me now, we have a more peaceable with the councillor, Mr. Gangaram Gopal. Uh. He just bring things and distribute. And we have the one of the best councillor. All the councillor is not bad. Before, I miss my just real good. And then we have Mr. Gangaram Gopal. He, you could see him 24 hours, he just passed through the village. Plus, we just do a lot of charity to my church. I think okay. I sent you a copy there of our working class from the, to my church. What church you have? So, we have a lot of cooperation now and things. We hope that will be continue and we will get more peace. So, we have a lot of more peace. He was blaming Philip because he was there, but Philip was the cause of no, no, no. Oh, you the pastor who, 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 who didn't know Philip Bodram? Yes. Or grow I know him. Or but he don't, I don't take donations, so he never helped, but I know him as a boy. All right. But any of your pastor, I wish you all the best, and it's very nice that you're trying to do something positive. I wish yeah, you all the best. Thank you. Yeah, doing a lot of help, but we Thank don't have a lot of crime again. And Thank you. So just to inform you, with respect to the, 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 the triple murder, the, the person that, that, that perished in the fire, it's a triple murder. Just to inform you that DNA evidence recently came back from the UK and investigators are following several leads into the triple murder. Crime scene investigators flood found blood splattered on the walls of the burnt house where three, where, where, where the three were found at the Petrogen quarters in Cochrane on, Cochrane on Friday 20th of February 2020 around 8.30. That evening police detained a person of interest or questioning but he was later released. Hannah, one of the persons that died, is a mother of three, broke off a relationship and left, left her home in South, as her, her home at South Central Road, point 14. And she was in that house. She was in that house. Cecilyn Farrell, an avid churchgoer, met Hannah through her church and took her home about four months ago. Four months prior to the incident. So you're still, you're, you're still holding it up. And uh, I tell you a story. Patrick Farrell, the next person who died in the house, lived in Tobago and, and at his mother's home in Guapo. He was one of his six children. Farrell had 17 grandchildren. So I'm just showing you. So Cecil met this girl four months in four months four prior to the incident and bring her home and say, well, look at a little place to stay. Not knowing she was running not knowing she was running and she was being stalked and that is why you have to know who running is when somebody's running from something i always remember that story eh? i always remember that story with jonah when you're running you see when you're running you can upset people life enough if you read the story about jonah it tell you the storm came and the sailors got scared and, you, and they had to get rid of Jonah. Jonah had to, because when people are running and they're running from something and you get involved with them, sometimes your life become a mess. You know? And you have nothing to do with that because remember, they, they, they're running from something. And that is why you have to be careful associating yourself with persons who are on the run. Look how sad it is for the persons in that house in Guapo where three of them perish in a fire. You find out they were murdered. Now you find out DNA results came back from the UK that it had blood all in the wall. It had persons that was released, all kind of thing. But the whole thing now took the whole thing, and I know the whole of point 14 watching me right now, just to let you, let you know. Well, the whole story turned now. The whole thing turned around now. That's all I can tell you. Not knowing that this girl was running. 
Not knowing that people get killed innocently. But we will leave it like that. We will leave it like that. Our second break, ladies and gentlemen, is brought to you by Gable X, by Gable X, by Varma Steel, SNS Passat Supermarket, Utterrek Japan, and Passage to Asia Ultra Inclusive. Let's take a fast break. Passage to Asia Ultra All Inclusive Carnival Kisses Sunday, 5th February 2023 St. Andrew's Golf Course Mocha Marava Get your tickets at Passage to Asia Wings Tuna Puna Extra Food River Lime Price Plaza MS Food City Day Day West Beach Diego Martin Richards West Mall Dave Siebelak Hardware Pinal S. Seepersad Hardware Maravella Brand Tech Londonville Lazy Lizard Rodney Road Call 672-2701 742-4309 685-8697 and 465-7322 Passage to Asia Carnival Kisses what once was glass is now plastic. You get all the benefits of glass without the drawbacks. And only Gable X packaging will get you there. Plastic application works with all the existing capping methods, so the change is simple and seamless. You get visual clarity without the fragility, as well as less scuffing, scratching, and label tearing. We do PET. PET brings many advantages. You get durability and rigidity. It's more economical, durable, recyclable, and beautiful. Our purpose is to help you profit from what's inside the package. And the outside profits the plants. Get ahead of the competition today. Contact Gable X Packaging Limited. Here's another reason to advertise on Crime Watch. Over 45 million views on YouTube alone. In the last six years, an outstanding 40 million views for 2022 and on track to surpass that in 2023. In just the previous month, we have surpassed over 1 million views and close to 200,000 hours of watch time. Can you imagine the reach our YouTube platform will get you? Don't forget, persons will also see your business every day by watching our live program on television, on our website, our iOS and Android applications, and of course, our Facebook page that boasts over 576,000 followers. Our packages are based on viewership so that your business can get the most exposure possible. Advertise where the people are watching. Advertise where it matters on Crime Watch. In construction, time is money. Get your roofing materials at the number one supplier, Varma Steel. Shop today, collect upon purchase, or have it delivered within 24 hours. 28 gauge pre-painted roofing sheets, $27 per foot. 26 gauge pre-painted roofing sheets, $36 per foot. Get pearlin, steel beads, high grade roofing sheets, chain link wire, decking pads, and much more at Varma Steel. Order, pay, collect, and go. It's that quick and easy. Visit, call, or WhatsApp today. Guess who's selling his vehicle? Ian Allen himself. Ride in style with a luxurious BMW M4 Sports. Low mileage and in top condition. For more information, call 294-4081. The launch of Bacchanal Bargains kicks off at SNS Passage Supermarket. Get everything you need for the road at unbeatable prices. Get Yum Yogurt, 4 ounce, 3 for $20. Ramen Delight, Chili and Chicken, 4 for $20. Goat, $34.95 per pound. White Oak Rum, 750ml, $105. Absolute Vodka, 750ml, $185. Coke Johnny Walker Black Label, 750ml, $270. Jack Daniels Assorted, 750ml, $265. Caribbean Stag Case, $195 and much more. Shop and win. All inclusive bet tickets when you spend $300 and over or win two. Tuesday on the Rocks tickets win one of six coolers filled with drinks. Spend $300 and over to enter. The freshest produce at unbeatable prices at our farmer's market last Saturday in every month. Number 91 High Street Rio Claro, 24 Cent Anne's Mayaro, and number 3 Guaya Guayari Main Road Mayaro. SNS Passage Supermarket. Simply better shopping. Auto Rec Japan Limited is having a massive parent sale at our Chamfret branch only. Everything must go. Starting Friday 13 January, while stocks last, come into 1B Eastern Main Road Pitibook Chamfret and get prices drastically slashed on door shelves, bumpers, bonnets, trunk lids, head and taillights, instrument panels, mirrors, shocks, and so much more. Check out our Bocal Road branch for new arrivals and parts. Give us a call for more information. Don't miss this.
Director, you know there's a place called Page Hill Road in Toko? No, it's a place called Bacchanal Street. Yeah, it's a place called Bacchanal Street. <laughs> Hold on, yeah? What the jail is this boy? I saved this person number in my phone, you know. I tell you, lady, you know, say, hey, come on. Oh, look at here, look at here. Here is Bacchanal, yeah? Here is Bacchanal. Here is Bacchanal in Toko right now. And Toko police, watch me, that them, watch, you're going to have a killing in Toko. Mark my word, you're going to kill this boy. This man have. Mike 2, are you using Mike 2? Hello. Hey, Ian Allen here, what's going on? We're live on national television, you okay? Yeah, everything okay. Ian, I want to ask you something. The fellow who shot you, who, who fired shots at you, what did that happen? Yeah. What well, did that happen? Yeah. That was um, last year. Last year? What day? What, yeah. what, 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 when last year? I can't remember what the look up in the file. In the, um, them, the that was in December, month or something? Or, 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 or November? Like after Christmas. After Christmas, right. But that is the same person, and he, that is the same person who threatening everybody and riding a bike with, with a firearm. Am I right? Yes. And you have a friend, this fellow who are on the who are on the phone near it, right? This man fired shots. What's he what's the fellow name? His first name. What's his first name? What is call him? What is the fellow who's the fellow with the gun? Dylan Lee. Dylan. Right? Everybody know Dylan. Everybody knows that it's alleged that Dylan hid in the bush and fired shots at this man. This man went and reported. He was this, right? Am, am I right? Did the police yes. do anything? Did the police in, in, no, in Togo do, do anything? Nothing. No, they didn't do nothing. I had to go grandy today. Uh -huh. And yesterday, he ended up pulling a fire away. He got another cutlass and my target shoot. So, so, what, so what the guy did again? He pulled a fire below a green jacket in front by Stacey. And he pulled a fire? Yeah, gone in the way. He, 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 like he hung on the U.S. and taken man. So I pulled a cutlass for him. And so I hear you want to walk with a cutlass in the road now because of the land? Yeah. And, to defend myself. And this is Matlat Police or Toko or is Toko Police Toko or Matlat Police. Station? Toko, Toko Police Station. Toko, Toko. The, the, this man went to Toko Police Station and nothing is happening you know? Nothing you know? This All boy right. shot behind me. Everybody know this boy walking with a gun in Toko. Right by Page, is, is Page Road? Page Street. Page Street in Toko. Everybody know Dylan have our fires. Everybody know that. Because I thought this guy was lying, but I started to get calls from different persons in Toko. And that is how, when, you, when, when somebody called me, I was able to tell them off the body, name of the street, and they were shocked. They were shocked, yeah. shocked, shocked. Yeah. So I'm just and telling you right now, about, if there are police that are watching, senior feet. police that are watching, this matter involving this young man, where it is alleged that Dylan fired shots at him, and... He had to walk with he had a cut last one because they, Dylan wanted to kill him. This is a matter. This right. man had to leave Toko because apparently Dylan have a friend in the police station. And that is true, yeah, some partner. Yes. Yes, Mr. Singh. Yeah, we, we, we know about that. Me know about no I, I know about that one. Me know about no names. Yeah. Right? But I don't know about no name, even though he just mentioned we don't know nothing about that. I just yeah. saying that flat. But it is alleged that Dylan has a friend that nobody's taking this boy report. And it's a serious thing. So I'm calling on Toko police. I am begging you, before this, this whole thing, before somebody had to bury somebody and undertake us and, and take that whole division into, the, into a crime scene, deal with this matter. Where this boy was shot at by Dylan, where he pulled a gun for him, and where the man had to go to San, but Grandy Police Station out to make an official report. So I'm just, I went you know, to the call back to the station where they tell me go back to the same officer tell him but I go there many times and he never All right, but just to let you know, everybody's paying attention to it now. Everybody. All so right. I said it on the air, everybody's paying attention. Yeah. This guy is marked for death and Dylan wants to kill him. Dylan has a gun and he's moving around in Toko. Please. Yeah, well, true, I mean, and, and, and All right, so... I'm calling on the police in Toko. I'm calling on the police on Grandi. Take, take this guy report seriously, please. That's all. Thank you. Bye-bye.
Okay. Also, ladies and gentlemen, also, also, want to say a special to Domas windows and doors. I was going to check them because I realized they have, um, they said that they have windows, glass windows, that you don't have to put burglar proof. Yeah, no burglar proof. Yeah. So, they're right on factory road. So, I was in the back there today and I almost pulled over, but I, I, I was running for time. I was early this morning, but I was running for time. Also, Civic Interiors, also a website company, also Neo Eyewear, Berberine Plus, Autorec Japan. Let's take a fast break. At Dumas Windows and Doors, we offer custom designs, solar e-glass that reduces electricity costs, security laminate glass that requires no burglar proofing, sound reduction by 35 decibels and more, professional installation and online payments available for quality. UPVC Solutions, call us today. Autorec Japan Limited is having a massive clearance sale at our Shamfure branch only. Everything must go. Starting Friday 13 January, while stocks last, come into 1B Eastern Main Road Pitibook Chamflair and get prices drastically slashed on door shelves, bumper, bonnets, trunk lids, head and tail lights, instrument panels, mirrors, shocks, and so much more. Check out our Bocal Road branch for new arrivals in parts. Give us a call for more information. Don't miss this. Do you want Ian Allen live at your business and seen on television? Then book your live now and promote your business the best way you can. Get one hour of ad-free live broadcasting on television and all our platforms. Don't wait. Spots are going quickly, so book now. Call 294-4081-225-4327 or 225-3250. Bring the style and durability of wood-finished SPC flooring to any room with Civic Interiors. Get 6mm SPC. SPC flooring with pad for $19.99 per square foot. SPC is waterproof, scratch resistant, with easy click, no mess installation. Perfect for any residential or commercial project. We have a variety of colors to choose from. Come in or give us a call. Civic Interiors, taking flooring to another level. Present your business professionally by calling a websitecompany.com. We'll create a website to expand and digitize your business, sell products, receive orders, and accept payments. Convert visitors into customers. Prices start as low as $3,500. No monthly or annual fees. Guess who's selling his vehicle? Ian Allen himself. Ride in style with a luxurious BMW M4 Sports. Low mileage and in top condition. For more information, call 294-4081. When NASA set out to explore the reaches beyond our world, they needed a material that would hold up to the demands of the unknown. Flexible titanium. Engineered from the same alloy used for missile heat shields, Flexon set the new standard in durable eyewear. Flexible titanium eyewear. Available at Neo Eyewear, 91D Main Road, Suite 1, Montrose Mall, Chagornas, 672-5052 or 3903196. Here's another reason to advertise on Crime Watch. Over 45 million views on YouTube alone in the last six years. An outstanding 14 million views for 2022 and on track to surpass that in 2023. In just the previous month, we have surpassed over 1 million views and close to 200,000 hours of watch time. Can you imagine the reach our YouTube platform will get you? Don't forget, persons will also see your business every day by watching our live program on television, on our website, our iOS and Android applications, and of course, our Facebook page that boasts over 576,000 followers. Our packages are based on viewership, so that your business can get the most exposure possible. Advertise where the people are watching. Advertise where it matters on Crime Watch.
ER professionals in general construction, paving, asphalt services and preparation of residential and commercial developments. At Liqua Construction Services Limited, our team of professionals has the knowledge, experience and resources to make your projects run smoothly, on time, on budget. We supply red sand, gravel, oil sand and more. Equipment rental available. 20-ton excavators, mini excavators, porter cool, bulldozers, concrete pumps and so much more. Contact us today for a free site visit and quote. First five orders will receive a gift voucher from Raquel Muda or a Robert Graham polo shirt. Introducing Berberine Plus by Aja Nutrition, a unique combination of all-natural super supplements Berberine, Bitter Melon, and Barnaba Leaf. Berberine Plus is clinically proven to provide diabetic support by decreasing insulin resistance, making the blood sugar lowering hormone insulin more effective, increasing glycolysis, helping the body break down sugars inside cells, decreasing sugar production in the liver, slowing the breakdown of carbohydrates in the gut. Available in TNT pharmacies nationwide. Boy, I watching our video, right? In tongue. I'm a monitor woman a bat, right? But I don't know if that is person from Lower Fort George because I know if he was on recently on bail or I don't know, I don't know. But I don't know, I don't know. But yeah, boy, but trip. if I have cussing, I'll look what can I take boy? If you see that, I can't, I can't hear that. You can go on my fan page and see it. Go on my fan page, let this girl put it up, Andrea. Yeah. So, so, so take off that part, take off that part, take it off, take it off. I can't show that kind of violence. Stop, 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 take it off. I can't show that kind of violence. But that real music, I do, I do not want one hand break. The man take up the bad man, it's back on our thing, boy, right in tongue and all. But if that man on bail, they say, I hear people say, no kind of thing, I don't know, but. That's a serious thing. But if she gone report it, she could get two charges there, you know. Charge for what? Um, assault and um, by beating and malicious damage to property. We can mash up a phone and thing. Yeah? People, hey, watch me. Trouble is come on a horse. Trouble is come fast and it is, it's flapping here. You want to take up a gun and you want to take up a knife and start people, boy, thing, 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 thing. And what about the one with the base, the man the baseball bat in San Fernando? Yeah? A taxi driver, you know? Hi, caller. Good evening. You're live on Crime Watch. Hi. Hi, Miss Allen. Good evening. Good evening. Miss Allen? Yeah. I'd like to speak to you uh, of the day concerning some charity money. I called it that day, um, and when you uh, get on the phone, the, the uh, call back, the number, um, time was up. Can I speak to you? Okay, day? somebody will take your number off the air. Okay, Thank you. very in it. I have some charity. Really. CCTV footage okay. has surfaced with the murder of Nicholas Thomas at Crystal Drive Car Wash, Crystal Drive Mover on Tuesday. 26-year-old Nicholas Thomas, who was outfitted with an electronic monitoring bracelet while on bail for robbery charges, was shot and killed in the kitchen of his home, located near Crystal Drive Car Wash at Lady Young Road and Mover. While cooking corn and pigtail, sometime after 9 p.m., Thomas was in his kitchen along with a friend, cooking when a man entered with a rifle and opened fire on him before fleeing the scene. Yeah, boy. Officers of Northern Div Northeastern Division who were the gunshots later located the scene and took Thomas to Port of Spain. General Hospital for treatment, but he died shortly. A man running with a fire, you know? He running as yet? We boy. That's the fella. No, Nicholas. Nicholas, right? This, this, this Nicholas, right? You see? Watch, watch, watch the fires now. Watch this. Run, run back and run back again. Look, look at that gun now. Smoke in the place, you know? Come back to me. Huh. You see that? Because Nicholas had a bracelet on his foot, you know, you know that, right? Yeah. Because Nic Nic Nicholas Thomas was outfitted with an electronic monitoring bracelet while on bail for robbery charge. So somebody come and deal with him, boy. Way. Also, CCTV footage has emerged showing Northeastern Division officers chasing one of the two Facebook bandits who shot an off duty officer during the Esting operation in Barataria. On Tuesday. That is excellent work, you know. Excellent, excellent work by the officers. Excellent. Yeah? CCTV. 
Watch me, shots firing, shots firing. Watch, watch, watch. Watch, watch, watch. Carl looking to pull out. Watch, watch, watch. Shots fired. Watch, watch, watch. Man down. Was a whole thing operation. A police in van and thing, you know. Look, my computer reversing. The computer. You gain out tight. You gain out tight. Shots fired, don't know. That TSTT. Look at the TSTT. All you're watching our TS. Okay. Now you will tell us it's done soup down, so? Hi, then shots fired. Start over the video. Shots out. Start over the video. Watch it. Watch, 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 watch. Watch. So the van open. They come out of the van, roadside vehicle. Watch, watch, watch the man from the white van, right? He run and shots fired. Watch, watch, watch. He close back the door. Police coming down. Watch, watch, watch. The, the, you remember that man waiting in a vehicle? The driver. Watch, watch, watch. He go down. Watch, he going down. Watch, 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 watch. First fire, watch. He pulling the partner off. Come down, boy. Go down on the ground, boy. Go down on the ground. Go down on the ground, boy. Lie down, boy. Shot stinging. Watch, watch, watch. That good. That good. That good. We Facebook. Are you on TV to sell again? All your gold chain and rims to sell again. Come out now. Jump out now. You're jumping out at all. You're jumping out at all. You're jumping out at all, at all, at all. A 23 year old man who was shot dead by police following the Massey store abduction robbery cursed his mother verbally abused her the same day he was killed by police. You know that? You know that? Yeah. He cost your mother stink. Don't cost your mother. Don't cost your mother. Cost yourself, but don't cost your mother. No matter how vexed you might get. No matter how vexed you might get. Somebody tell me the man with the bat that's working the oval as a security, that you? <laughs> Somebody telling me that he's working the, some oval thing. He's working the oval as a security guard, the man with the bat. Okay. Okay. Good night. A 23-year-old man who was shot dead by police following the Massey store abduction. Now looking to see because I wanted some information concerning this. Okay. 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 Somebody gonna cuss me. Yeah, you gonna cuss me up. Yeah, no, no, you go here. This one here, this one, researcher. I get it, but I had it all the time. You know what I'm talking about? You know what I'm talking about, right? I sent it on the group. 23 year old man who was shot dead by police following the massive store abduction and robbery cursed his mother and verbally. Yeah, have a right, cuss, cuss, I ain't no cussing in my earpiece. Abused her the same day he was killed by police. Emirate, um, Emirate Ramisa, who was shot. Who was shot? Who was shot dead during a confrontation with Southern Division Police on January when he had when he and two other men pretending to be police officers hijacked the manager vehicle of Massey. Ramisa mother Natasha Gregg said, I Craig, Natasha Gregg, I told Natasha Gregg. Craig. Yeah. Wait, boy, we're shouting the mayor so far. Oh good. Natasha Craig said, I told him that Friday morning to come out of my house and he real cussed me up. When I told him that, he even told me not to look, not to look at him when I see him in the road. And that was my last interaction with my son. When he came, when he came by me to live in Chase Village, after he came out of prison, I saw the hours he was leaving and coming back and I saw him buying clothes, but he doesn't have a job. Which young man at that age going out from 10 in the, 10 in the night and coming back until... 10 next, 10 next day, 10 a.m. 
He leaving up 10 a.m. and come back 10 p.m. Sometimes even 2 a.m. the following morning. That was Mother's Day. When I saw him coming in, 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 in those hours, I told him, I hear what's going on. You have to get a place and me able with that. You know, I have an eight-year-old to think about. Ask, a, ask what, a, what a advice was to other parents of troublesome children. Greg mother said it was necessary for parents to, be, to, to set the um, boundaries for their children and take action if they broke the law. Do not condone your child when you know, when, when you know they are not doing right. Set them right, set them right, because you, you, you as a parent in the long run will burn for it. I have some mothers with, with their children doing these things, and they condone it, but not me. The two other suspects was arrested and subsequently charged by police. So this one, just to understand, he come in all hour in the night. He come in all hour. He mother say he come, he leaving in the morning, he come in the night, he went out in a fancy clothes. Brands, only brands, only brands thing, but this time he's walked the point down now. He works nowhere, he draws no pay. But he, he branding down, but he flexing. He mother talk to him. He tell all oh, the mother, so and so, oh, they, no, watch me, no, don't watch me. He cuss up the woman, he cuss up his mother that Friday morning. Because he said, dramatize the woman to her, dramatize she. Because she look like a lady, he said, well, the car be coming here, and I, I see me, I hear my little life here. You can't play coming because you know come out of jail and all kind of thing, 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 thing. The woman put on she foot. You see? Look where he end up. A few hours later, he get gone down in the mass thing. He get killed. He get killed. Police kill him. He now robbery thing. Hijack the mass manager. But all that's still investigating. All that's still investigating. It's not done yet. The investigation is still ongoing. Still ongoing. But I'm just showing you now. I'm just showing you. Right? Terrible. 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 Man, cuss up your mother. Open up your lines. Open up your lines. Papa can spit you. Cuss up your mother, you know. Yeah, I guess I must take this call. Hold on, yeah. I'm live on television. Tell me fast. Yeah. Okay. No, we're still working on something. We aired we aired, we aired it yesterday. Okay, no problem. Remember, do not forget, because we have to get some more footage with respect to the stolen SUV, the two Sonia. Yeah? All right? The two, the, the, with, with, with the guy. Because we really need to know who is, who is this guy. We really, really need to know who is this guy. We really need to, because we, we have posted it on all of our platforms, trying to gather whatever information. Yeah, this is the guy walking there. If you have any information, then we have some shots, you know, some still shots. If we can get all those, those, those still shots, that would be great. If you can get this a still shot of him, it had a still shot we posted yesterday. Go ahead, we have it. Do I have it? Okay, so I'll show you how, how the driver read to son. Look at him here. Look at him. This is him, I see. Yeah. Yeah. Massy is it's it's an everybody massy. I I have to tell you about tomorrow. I have to tell you. Can I show you a photograph of the of the two son? The guy, if you, if you, if you take, take off the CG bar again. Did we run, we ran this yesterday? After seven, yeah, we ran it yesterday after seven. So go back, on, go back online and watch it. Look at the guy again. If you know him, tell me. Does he work for anybody in the bamboo? You feel he working for anybody in the bamboo? 
Tell me. If we could run with that one time, I think we could run with that one time. Or oh, 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 what, oh, what, oh, what, watermark. Okay, yeah, because we have somebody to tell you about, about Marcy. Two teenagers were arrested after they stole a vehicle in Central Trinidad. Reports that the man, the, the man parked his vehicle at his home before going to bed. When he awoke next morning around 9.30, he discovered his car missing. The report was made and based on the information received, officers executed a search warrant at the home of two 16-year-old in Tenopuna and later arrested them. 16-year-old, no? Later, after this car thief, and then, uh, somebody lost the gray, the gray aqua vehicle right from Mid Center Mall today. Right? Yeah, they lost the, they lost the gray aqua from its Mid Center Mall. A stolen, also a stolen boat and a boat engine were recovered in the sea, in sea lot, sorry, during an intelligence led exercise on Tuesday. The 17th of January. The a rescue boat was among several vehicles successfully recovered by officers this week across the country on going crime, crime, anti crime exercise. The deflated boat and boat engine were reported missing on Wednesday, the 11th of January 2022, last year, and were recovered by police of the Criminal Investigation Department operational team in the Sealots District. So let's imagine that. Since last year, they, since last year, that that was that that was reported missing by the owner, 11th of January 2022, and were recovered by police. So the stolen boat and a boat engine were recovered in the Sealots area during an intelligence-led exercise. Also, investigation continues in incident in which an 18-year-old woman was stabbed about the body allegedly by her ex-boyfriend outside her Maloney Gardens home. But you see, 18 year old, 18 year old, I won't go along that road. I ain't gonna go along that road. Adiana Richards, because it's pretty girl, this, 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 this girl so pretty. Remains was in a stable condition after she was stabbed in the throat and backed by her children's father, 25 year old Marlon Madu. That's <laughs> real sad. But he has a history. He has a history. Who taped this? Who? But who taped this? The same fever um, ca um, cameraman we have. Well, well, I'm shaking so much. Who is this? Well, you're a failure thing with all this. Real failure thing. So we, look at the 18 year old girl, a nice girl. Get stabbed up, watch. But I hear, I, I hear the hell mala on you. You, 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 you watch me. You can't go up in the building and play a flexing, boy. You can't be, you can't be riding up nobody in the building, so. And po a police passing and see men running them down, you know. But if the police wasn't there, they'd deal with him. He going to stop the year right in she place, yes? I think it's easy. Also, ladies and gentlemen, a man suffered severe injury during an explosion at a fuel transport de depot in Enterprise. Around 11.45, the worker was welding on a tank when the explosion took place. I want no, 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 no. It have, it have a company that transport gas and is attached to Freedom Road, Freedom Street. Yes, I know, I know, I know the owner of the company. I know, I know the owner of the company because it had a time, it had a guy in Coover was seen coming out of a, of a back road a back road, but the same. A day I coming out, a, okay. I come out a Coover, passing through the side, and I see a, a, a tanker coming out of the bush, a old road, with a, with a, um, one of those trucks that have the plastic container that they, that, that they could fill diesel with now. 
So I don't know. Apparently, the truck driver cut some flick with the, with the, with the fella in the van. Yeah, and I, I think I met the owner and brought it to his attention and give, and give him the, 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 the number of the truck and thing. Yeah, because apparently he was selling to the fella who was driving the little van and he had the big plastic container that, yeah. So what tanker coming out of a, 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 a grass road for? So I observed that and I, and I so I, I ran a search and realized, but wait now, that, that gas company in Freedom Street, so I'm like, wait up, a gas person, and then I, then one, but one day things happened so that I met the owner and, and then he identified himself and the, it's a family business and they work really hard. So I only hope that this is not this person severe injured during an explosion of fuel transport depth. Yeah. Also, ladies and gentlemen, AGC officials moved in with bulldozers and a police in La Hoketa where the corporation tore down several vending structures which said was erected illegally on Thursday, the 19th of January. One resident, Crystal Manswell, described the agency action as heartbreaking. So look at the back and all. Ask any government for handouts, for hampers, for assistance. So, um, since COVID hit, people have been going through a lot of economic issues, unemployment. The people of this community is trying to do something positive. They're not begging for hampers. They're not asking for financial assistance. All they're asking is for the relevant authorities to come to work with us so that we can have something positive. They're not just breaking down bricks here, you know, they're breaking down dreams, they're breaking down hopes to live, move away from the life of crime, to move towards something positive. To become business owners, that's what we want. We want that for these sorts of communities so that they can aspire to better. It is something legit, it is something legal as registered business owners that have this. We are just asking. And you see, you see, you see what's going on now? Apparently, no, no, that doesn't give the people the right to erect any stuff. Any building just so on state land or whatever. But I don't know the circumstances. But nevertheless, listen to the story. I tell you, that is why I tell you, we are living in a time that people just want to live. People do not want back and all. If you listen to that girl and she's saying that we want to be a business owner, we know how to start. So we're selling things on the road, we're selling stuff, they build up maybe a little shell and whatnot. And but you know, yes, sometimes you have to go and find it. Let's see how we can maybe, maybe, um, Maybe see how we can help them. See, let them go, put them on. Let let let, let different ministry, ministry is Netco. Netco is the person who's giving loans and whatnot, right? Let Netco officials from Netco get involved and say, okay, we're gonna see if we can give you a little ten thousand, a little fifteen thousand loan if you wanna start a business. All them thing, you gotta think, you gotta think. So you find out. So what they're doing there? They wreck stuff. What they're selling? You selling container? You selling juice? You selling chow? Okay, you can't come with that bulldozer and just mash up people. Think okay, we understand, but it is a bigger pit here. It is a bigger pit here. You need to go in and, and speak to people. What is happening here? Well, you know, I give you all the notice. All I can't do this, you know. We gotta break it down. But then in doing that, I say here what? Since since I, since I, I, you are displaying signs of ambition, signs of ambition. Let's get Netco and let's get the different agencies to see how we could create entrepreneurships. You understand? Entrepreneurs. And see how we can help people. See, see? That is what I tell you. We're not on back and all. We're not on no ex no 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 up no 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 senator saying this and saying that. We're not on no back and all again. People want seriousness. So this is Ian Allen, this is Crime Watch. Thanks for advertising with me. Thanks for supporting me. Again, everybody's watching. You have a great evening. I'll be back tomorrow. I have so much to tell you. We have so much on this paper here that we did, I didn't even finish, but for one of time. Have a good night. God bless you. And what's up me on 294-4081. Thank you. Yeah.